Market information for April 2024. In Calgary, our city is growing fast. Last quarter, nearly 41,000 people moved here, making it one of the busiest places in Canada. But what does that mean for house prices? Let's find out. Calgary is cheaper than many big cities in North America, which means it's a popular place to live. While places like Vancouver and Toronto are very expensive, Calgary is more affordable. Interest rates, which affect how much it costs to borrow money for a house, are staying the same for now. This is good news and is one reason why so many people are moving here. Right now, there aren't many houses available to buy, and this has been the case since 2006. In March, there were 22% fewer homes to buy than last year, and most of these homes cost more than 700000 which is so few homes available. The prices of homes have gone up a lot. For example, the typical single family home now costs 740,000, which means 14% more than last year. Looking ahead, we expect things to stay pretty much the same. There won't be many houses available and the interest rates will likely stay steady. This situation makes it hard for people to buy homes. But it also means that homes under 600000 might become more valuable. If you're thinking about buying or selling a house, now is a good time to learn and make choices. Don't forget to subscribe for more updates like this. If you found this video helpful and comment below with any questions or what you want to see next, I'm here to help you understand the Calgary real estate market. It's important to be informed so you can make the smartest choice. Thanks for watching and let's navigate this exciting market together.